In this video, I'm going to walk you through the unit update the exchange rate with ACM. This is the second unit in prepare your Salesforce org for our users. Along the way, I'll explain any concepts that seem a little bit difficult or confusing. I've added bookmarks so you could jump to any part that you need a little additional help. Let's get to it. Enable advanced currency management. Click the gear icon and set up. And again, eventually, Trello stops giving that instruction because you just got to know how to do that one. Enter Manage Currencies in the Quick Find box and select Manage Currencies. If Manage Currencies does not appear, <clears throat> excuse me, enter company information. It does. Fantastic. Click Enable under Advanced Currency Management if it's not enabled. Advanced Currency Management is not enabled, so we're going to click Enable. Yes, I want to enable advanced currency management. Enable. On the confirmation that appears, select yes. Oops. Well, goodness, I already did that. And then click enable. Depending on your browser, you may need to click open. And a new tab will open in classic. Okay. Uh, if you're brand new, you probably don't know what classic is. Salesforce got started in 1999. And the user interface, right? The thing that the administrator and uh, the users would interact with was, let's just say, very early 2000s. So not very pretty. The new interface is called Lightning, and this is a much easier to use and much nicer. Um, so a lot of the instructions on Trailhead, though, still provide instructions for both Lightning and Classic because some Salesforce orgs are still using Classic. So there you go. All right, I think we're ready to go. Update the Euro exchange rate with the start with a start date. Click Manage Dated Exchange Rates and click Continue on the splash screen. Click Manage Dated Exchange Rates. Manage Dated Exchange Rates and click Continue on the splash screen and then. Click new exchange rates and then complete the fields. Start day, first day of next month, and Euro 1.13. Okay. And then we got click save, I'm certain. If you're in a classic tab, close it. This is lightning. If you're just starting now, it's lightning. Don't worry. Edit the Euro currency test opportunity. Next, edit the close date on the Euro opportunity to see how the converted amount changes depending on the exchange rate. Click the app launcher and select sales. Click the opportunity tab. From recently viewed opportunities, click Euro currency test and click the details tab to compare the converted amount to the one you noted earlier. So let's do this. Sales, opportunities, recently viewed list, Euro currency test, details. So let's click um, edit. And we're going to change the close date to change the close date to the first date of the next month. and then click save. And then the anticipated revenue just went down in dollars. Euros, it stayed the same. Notice that the converted amount has changed because the new exchange rate is being used. Now that we've applied advanced currency management option, let's continue customizing, but this time for specific profiles. The VP of support has requested a unique homepage for the support team. Let's customize it. First, we're going to verify this step. 